Oh my goodness. Good morning, everyone. I am obviously just awoken with puffy eyes and everything. So I have these little eye masks that I do every morning pretty much because I'm really tired and I have dark circles under my eyes. But anyway, um, I just thought I would vlog today and I just woke up. Obviously, like I said, I'm going to do my skincare, put my face on, look a little bit more presentable because this is, you know, the outfit right now. It's not super cute. Um, and I'm just going to take you guys with me for my day. I have to go to the Verizon store, unfortunately. It's like my least favorite place to go to besides getting gas in my car because my phone is just completely broken. I'll show you guys when I get in my car. Um, it's just, I have no idea. It's just spazzing and freaking out, but it's okay. It's still going to be a great day. I did my morning yoga stretching this morning, so I am zen. That's a new thing I'm starting, so I'm a little bit more relaxed and stuff. I'm going to first do my skincare, wash my face, um, get ready, put my face on, because obviously looking a little crazy, um, and get ready for the day and just take you guys with me and see what I get up to in another day. Day 552 of quarantine. Let me turn this down real quick. Okay, sorry that my steering wheel is in the way, but can you see me? I'm trying to like, I forgot my little, uh, what's it called when you like hold the tripod thing. So I'm just holding just the camera, but I know the wheel is kind of blocking me, but whatever. But anyway, just pulled up to the Verizon store. Let me show you what's actually happening with my phone. It's really strange. Um. I don't know. Now it's probably not going to do it because I'm here. So anyway, so wants to show the Apple ID. And then once I go to it, let's see. So see, I don't know if you can see. That's what's happening. And it's been like that. It's freaking out. But anyway, just pulled up to the Verizon store. I'm in the center that I used to literally go to every day. And I just realized I haven't been here in six months. So, wow. Time really flies when you're not doing anything and you're in quarantine. But anyway have my mask I'm hoping it's not too busy because again you know still kind of on lockdown I don't even know at this point so hoping it's not too busy and they can just fix it and everything will be fine but you just never know with these Verizon stores it's kind of like going to the DMV you can be there for hours sometimes so let's just keep our fingers crossed that's definitely not the case oh, my phone hates me won't even let me turn it off now <sighs> Okay, I am actually shocked. That was such a pleasant experience. They did it so quickly. The girl was super sweet. She fixed it. She helped me. And also, I got a new, I don't know if you can see. You can't really tell probably on here. But like a new, um, what's it called? Like the screen or whatever. So I feel like I just got a new phone. So that was really nice. Wow. It's going to be a good day. Because usually when I go to the Verizon store, I prepare to be there for like at least three hours. And then for it still not to work. And then for me to have to go back for like the next week until it finally works. But that was really, really good. So now I think I'm just going to run to the market, grab my English muffins. Because I'm out of my favorite English muffins. And that cannot happen because I'm starving. So I've got to make breakfast. And then I'm going to maybe pick up a little celery juice. Um in this cute little like smoothie place right next door to the market just because I'm really trying to be healthy. Um, but yeah, we'll see, maybe not. I'm probably gonna do it actually, let's be honest. <laughs> You got a roommate, call me when there's no one there Put the key under the mat and you know I'll be over there I'll be over there, shawty, I'll be over there I'll be hitting all the spots that you ain't even know was there Ha! Okay, quick little grocery haul I literally only got three things I just got some spinach I got my favorite Dave's Killer Bed English muffins You guys know I have these every morning for breakfast And then I got some chickpea pasta I was only going to get the English muffins, but of course, you know, you go into the market, you end up getting a few extra things, but it could have been worse if you know me. You know, I go a little crazy at the market sometimes. But. Okay, I'm going to go get my celery juice right now because I am literally here. It was right next to the market, and I've been doing the celery juice every single week, and honestly, I feel pretty good. And this is a big announcement, you guys. I'm honestly not having any caffeine right now. I'm doing a caffeine cleanse, which if you know me... You know I love my Starbucks, my iced coffee, so it's really hard for me, but I just decided that I need to do a little caffeine cleanse for a while. My body's been pretty stressed out, and I think it needs to just chill, and obviously caffeine raises your cortisone levels and all that stuff and just kind of causes your body to stress out a little bit more. So we don't need any more added stress, so I've been doing celery juice instead, 
And, you know, it's not great. It's not terrible. I don't mind it. Sometimes it's better than others, depending on if like, the celery is, like, sweeter. I don't know how to describe it. But it's really not that bad. I've been doing it every morning um, on an empty stomach, so I haven't eaten anything yet. It's like, oh, it's 11. Well, i got to eat something. It's, like, 11 right now, so I'm going to get this. Um, I've also sometimes been getting protein shakes from this place as well because it's really good. I'm not going to this morning just because it's a little bit cold. It's a little chilly out today, so... I don't want to get one now. If I get one, maybe I'll get one like later um, after my workout today or maybe I'll just like make one at home if I want. Um, but I am going to definitely go get my celery juice because, you know, we're on this new like healthy, chill wavelength with my juice. I literally used to make fun of people who get juice and now I'm freaking getting juice every day. Whatever. I'm going to go get it now. <laughs> Okay, got my juice. Oh, it's good. It's really good today, actually. It's kind of like a sweeter, whatever, celery thing. It's not great. Not great. But it's really not that bad. And then I also got my sister a peanut butter chocolate protein shake, which I'm going to do my very best to not put the straw in until I give it to her because otherwise I'll just end up drinking the entire thing before we get home. And she'll kill me. But anyway, I'm going to drink this whole juice. And then I'm going to go home and make my breakfast. Because I'm really hungry, guys. So, see you when I make my breakfast. Good morning. <laughs> my little smusheroo. Doing the ice roller. Ooh, we love a girl who takes care of her skin. Self-care Tuesday. Totally fabulous Tuesday. <laughs> Okay, my breakfast is literally the same thing I've had every day for probably five years. Just my egg white scramble with um, mushrooms, onions, spinach, turkey bacon. I'm going to add a bunch of nutritional yeast on there as well. And then my English muffin. I'm going to heat this up in the toaster and put oh, the best dairy-free cream cheese I have ever had. This is literally the best thing to happen to me all 2020. I'm not joking. Kristen, how proud are you of me that I only had three sips of your protein shake? That's a new record. Normally, I drink at least half. I'm very proud of you. Very your skin proud. looks really good today. Look, you're just glowing. Cute. Oh my god, so cute. <laughs> gym very sweaty very hot it was a really really good leg day I didn't finish um or I didn't film a lot for you guys I only think I filmed me doing hip thrust just because like with COVID and everything it's kind of busy you have a, like a time limit so I didn't want to like waste my time and be annoying with my camera but I do post like all of my workouts on my Instagram so if you're watching this video and you're not following me on Instagram definitely make sure you go do so I'll put it right here um but I'm back now and I'm just gonna make myself a protein shake so I'm just gonna do I'm um, gonna skip with this chocolate vegan protein powder from um, P science this one's really good it's a chocolate bliss flavor um, some peanut butter frozen banana ice and almond milk and that's pretty much it that'll be like a little snack and then I'm gonna make dinner in probably about an hour or so Oh yeah, and then I also got, um, I took my little sister to Starbucks. She needed a little study break from school, so I just got a passion iced tea. I got a venti iced tea with no sweetener, no ice, and then I got a Trenta cup of ice, and I kind of just mix it in with some uh, strawberry kiwi BCAs. It's like so good. It's the perfect like summer little like drink. Can you see me? Oh my gosh, it's so dark. Oh, your food okay. came? Oh, perfect. Okay, so I'm just making a burrito bowl. I'm obsessed with these right now. So I'm just doing some chicken, grilled chicken breast, and I just season it with some garlic salt and then like this little like carne, I don't know, it's kind of like a Mexican, um, really, really good like chicken seasoning. And then I put a little bit of lemon juice on that. So that's cooking. And then I'm making some cauliflower rice right now. 
just because it's frozen so I have to like saute it. And I love this cauliflower rice because you can have so, so much of it and it's a little bit lower carb and I like to have like higher carb, like you'll see. You'll see, I'll have like oatmeal and all this crazy stuff tonight. But anyway, I seasoned this cauliflower rice just with a little bit of chili powder, a little bit of cumin, cumin, cumin? It's cumin, right? I think it's cumin, I don't know. Lari seasoning salt, duh, and some garlic powder, baby. And we're just gonna season this, and then I'm gonna add some like spinach and some other veggies in here, and then I'm making a really good like sauce out of avocado and hummus, and all that fun stuff. So this is like my favorite meal right now. I've literally been having it for dinner like every single bite. And little baby over here, what did you get for dinner? Islands. You got islands? What did you get? Let's see. Ooh, she got some chili cheese fries and some chicken tenders with ranch. Proud of you for the ranch. They actually gave it to me. I totally forgot about the ranch again. Oh, thank God. <laughs> see, thank not God. all heroes wear capes. <laughs> okay, so this is the finished product. It looks a little bit gross because the sauce I made, if you can tell, it's like hummus mixed with avocado. And it looks prettier when it's just avocado, obviously, but it's just a, ah, it's hot, sorry. It's like a huge, pretty big bowl. Put some like romaine lettuce and spinach at the bottom. Then I have the cauliflower rice in there. Got the avocado, the hummus um, sauce that I made, chicken. Um, some shredded lettuce and then I'm also gonna have this sauce too on it on the side It is so good. This is literally like the best sauce ever if you're having like tacos or anything like that So super excited again. This is literally my favorite dinner ever right now uh, Hello, like your dad. Really I know she barely eats anything I ate three of the chicken tenders. You come six. Yeah, it does because she orders like a whole appetizer one yeah, I don't, I didn't appetize one. Yeah. How was your day today like your dad? My day was okay, honey. How was your day? It's pretty good. How was your coffee cake? I don't need the coffee cake. What? Love you. Love you. Love you too. Alrighty, my last meal and my favorite meal ever, ever. It's my dessert every single night. I'm not joking. Every night for at least two years now. It is a cup of oats. I put some vanilla flavor drops, stevia, cinnamon, and then I have this super, super good a serving of this like cinnamon snickerdoodle almond butter so i kind of rotate different almond butters but right now that's my jam and this is literally my favorite part of the day and it's a pretty darn big bowl of oats if you know me you know this is literally my favorite meal in the entire world i could have it three times a day sometimes i honestly do have it three times a day but today we're just having it once because we're trying to balance things out but anyway my favorite meal saving the best for last Okay, so I think I'm going to go ahead and close out the video today. I think it's long enough. Um, I hope you guys liked it. It was just like a little day in the life um, when I'm not working or anything. Obviously, we're in quarantine, so I'm not working too, too much. But the Lakers are playing. Um, but they have a few days off because it's going into the second round. But they beat the Portland Trailblazers really early. So they got themselves a few extra days rest before the second round starts. So I have a few kind of days where I'm just chilling. So yeah, it was actually a really, really good day. So I'm happy that I took you guys with me. Hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I hope you guys liked seeing what I ate. Um, sorry I wasn't able to film more of my workout for you guys. But again, I will have the whole workout. I'm actually making the video right now. The workout video from the workout that I did today. I'm going to be posting on my Instagram. So again, if you don't follow me on Instagram, definitely make sure to do so. And oh my gosh, I was going to say until next time, like your hand is out. But I guess until next time, Hannah is out. I'm just going to eat my last meal, my oatmeal, go for a walk with my dad, um, and then get a shower, do some stretching, maybe watch a TV show, and then go to sleep. And that's going to be it. But I hope you guys like this vlog. And until next time, Hannah is out. Bye, guys.